today for math, we are recalling sums for basic facts using properties and strategies. Right now, we are using base 10, uh, well, not base 10 block, but uh, 10 frames to find answers that make 10, okay? So, boys and girls, I have a story for you. There are six dog bones and four dog biscuits. How many dog treats are there? Which one of those ten frames show that? Six dog bones, four dog biscuits. Which one of those, which one of these ten frames showing that? Six dog bones, four dog biscuits. What do you think, Emma? Top right? You guys agree? Yes. Yes, because there are six red for the dog bones and four yellow for the dog biscuits. How would we write that um, number sentence? Hudson? Six plus four equals ten. Yes, six plus four equals ten. Good job. Okay, we're going to try another one. Are you ready? What if there were five bones and five biscuits? Which frame would that one be, Nicholas? The other side. The one right beside it? Yep. Okay, how do you write that number sentence, Vivian? Five plus five equals ten. Alright, good. And what if there were eight bones and two biscuits? Liam, which one would that go to? Um, the one on the four, six plus four. You guys agree? Yeah. Okay, can you, who can tell me how to write that? Ellie? Eight plus two equals three. What are all these equaling, boys and girls? Ten. Ten. Are all this, is these, are these frames all filled up? Yeah. yeah, there might be different colors of counters, but they're all filled up, aren't they? Yeah. Okay, so what do you think? Make a prediction, like you do in reading. What are the, all the answers going to be? Ten. Ten, okay, let's see if you guys can keep doing this. Nine bones and one biscuit. Grayson? The very, very bottom. You guys agree? Yes. Okay, Haley, how do you write that? Good. And the last one, boys and girls. Actually, I want you to tell me how many dog bones? Seven. Seven. And how many biscuits? Three. Three. And how do I write that? Seven, Seven plus three equals ten. Good job. Turn your page over. Okay, boys and girls, we are making, sometimes when we add, we want to make 10 first and then add more if it's a teens number, because sometimes getting to the teens is kind of hard, okay? Like 7 plus 5 is their example up here, okay? 7 plus 5. You need to add 3 to 7 to make 10, right? If you know your 10 facts, you know how to make 10. 7 is your first number. You know you need 3 more just to get to 10, right? Okay. So if you break apart 5, this is going to be a harder lesson today, okay? You break apart 5 as in being 3 and 2 instead. Because you know 7 and 3 will make 10. So once you have this, this is 10, right? Those two together? What's 2 more? 2 more than 10 is? 12. So 7 plus 5 is? 12. This is kind of hard. It is kind of hard. Okay? Probably what I'm going to do is I'm going to do some of these problems with you, and then I'm just going to let you choose. If you would rather just add, I will let you just add. This is just a strategy.
strategy, okay? This is an option for some of you. If you feel like you can really do this and it's, it makes it faster for you, then you can do it this way, okay? Add this way. If it does not help you and you think this is way harder, I'm just going to have you add, okay? Um, we might have to, though, do it as much as possible on here, okay? All right, so show how you can make 10 to find the sum. So they want you to make 10 no matter what, okay? 8 plus what is 10, boys and girls? 8 plus 2. two. two. Okay, so they broke apart this 3 into 2, and then 2 plus what is 3? 2 plus what is 3? 1. 1. Okay. So, 2 plus, 8 plus 2 is 10, okay? These two equal 10. Plus one more, what does that equal? 11. 11. You can write 11 up here. It just pulled the answer. It looks like it just pulled the answer on this side. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Uh, you're saying the number two kind of looks like that again? Well, two can be split up and we have nine, right? Nine's your big number. So they're trying to get you to make ten. If you have nine, how many more do you need to make ten? One. One. So they, they're making the two be two ones instead. Okay? So that makes ten. Ten, what's the, if we had one one and one nine, we use those two to make ten. The one that's left over, what is that? So you put the one right here, okay? Ten plus one is what? Eleven. And then you just write your answer on top again. Okay? Time up. We'll keep working. Okay. So let's look at this. Eight and five, right? Okay. Eight plus what meet can be ten? Eight plus what is ten? Two. Okay, so we're going to break five into two... And what other number? What other number would help you make five? Two and what else? Three. Three. Okay, so put your carrot little thing. Point. Yeah, carrot point. And make two and then three. Okay. Now, we're going to, we, what did we use to make ten? Eight, right? So let's cross off eight. And two, right? So cross off two. What number is left over, boys and girls? Three. three. So you're going to put three down here with ten. Okay? Ten plus three is what? Thirteen. So eight plus five is? Thirteen. Okay? Let's keep doing them together because I want to make sure that you really know how to do this before we start. Yes, Ellie. If you are adding and not doing it this way, you just replace the zero with the two. Oh, yeah. For 10 plus 3. But that may not always work, don't we? So don't think like that, okay? All right. 4 plus 7. What's the bigger number? 7. 7. So we're going to use 7. We're going to break apart the 4. Make your carrot. Carrot. That's what I'm going to call it, a carrot, okay? All right, seven plus what is ten? Seven plus three. Plus three. So we're going to break four into three and what other number? One. Okay, now what numbers are we using to make ten again? The seven, right? And three is ten. So cross those two off. And what do we have left over? One. So 10 plus 1 is? 11. 11. And then we can write 11 up here. That's a lot of 11. That is a lot of 11. Three eleven. It's 3 11. It's 3 11. Okay, let's do 9 plus 3. You guys tell me what to do. Carrot under the 3. So, 9 plus what equals 10? 
9 plus 1. Okay. But what else do we need to make 3? 1 and what other number? 2. 2. Okay. Now can we cross off the two numbers that make 10? Yes. What two numbers make 10 again? 9 and 1. 9 and 1. So what number do we have left over? 2. And what is 10 plus 2? 12. 12. This makes sense. You can try the last one by yourself. That's fine. Okay. Try the last one by yourself. Yep. Okay, write the missing add ins that make the number sentence true. Okay, boys and girls, these are a little hard. Okay? You have to decide. What is 9 plus 6? We have those two add-ins at least. Okay? 9 plus 6. Who can tell me what that equals? Liam? 15. 15. Okay. What plus 5 equals 15? What plus 5 equals 15? Hudson? 10. 10. 10 plus 5 is 15. Okay, so number 16. What two numbers do we know do we have that we can add together for sure? What two numbers can we add together for sure, Grayson? 8 and 5. 8 and 5. What is 8 plus 5, boys and girls? 13. 13. Okay, 10 plus what is 13? 3. Everyone? 3. Three. Okay, we can add 10 plus 2 down here, right? What is 10 plus 2, boys and girls? 12. 12. 7 plus what is 12? 5. 5. Five. 10 plus 4 is what? 14. 14. 6 plus what is 14? Six plus six is twelve. Okay, what's fourteen and um, from twelve? Eight. 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 Two more would be eight. Yes. Okay, we still have three minutes, so we're gonna do the back side too. Real quick. Yes, that's kind of a lot of easy. All right, number twenty-one. Max is thinking of a doubles fact. Doubles means. Adding the, the same, same number. Okay, it has a sum, which is the oh, answer, that is greater than the sum of 64. Or 6 plus 4. What is 6 plus 4, guys? 10. Okay, it has to be greater than 10. Greater than 10. But it's less than 8 plus 5. What's 8 plus 5? 13. 13, okay, it has to be less than 13. Okay? What fact is Max thinking of? Okay, it's a double fact. So it's more than 10 and less than 13. More than 10 and it's doubling. What is more than 10 and less than 13, Nicholas? Six plus six, what does that equal, guys? Twelve. Oh. Is twelve more than ten? Yes. Is it less than thirteen? Yes. yes. All right, you got it. 